Welcome to the Majesta Easy Flush Series. Easy toilet fixes with licensed plumber, Tammy Buchanan. Hi, I'm Tammy. Today, I'll be walking you through the easy process of changing your toilet flapper. First, let's identify whether or not you need to replace your flapper. There's a few signs to indicate this. First, look inside your bowl, all around the rim of your toilet bowl. If there's little streams of water falling down in your bowl, that is definitely a sure sign that you need a new flapper. Number two, listen to your toilet. If you hear trickling water inside of the tank of your toilet and there's no visible signs of water outside, that's definitely a sign that you need a new flapper. A third test that you can do, if your flapper is more than five years old, I would suggest you do this. Put a couple drops of food coloring in your tank. Wait 15 minutes. And come back and check the inside of your bowl. If any of that food coloring has made it into the bowl, you definitely have a problem with your flapper. And be sure that after you do this test, to give it a couple flushes to make sure that the food coloring doesn't stay in the inside of your bowl. So now that we've identified that you need a new flapper, let's talk about the various types of flappers that there are out there on the market. I'm gonna be demonstrating how to change the flapper on a dual flush toilet and on the old flapper style toilet. So let's change out the flapper on our dual flush toilet. First, we're gonna shut off the water. And then we're going to drain the tank. Now we're going to place our hands around the body of the fill valve of this toilet. And give it a twist and pull it out. The only part you need to replace on this style flapper is this bottom rubber. So I'm going to take my flathead screwdriver and I'm going to reach in the bottom of the rubber. This rubber is very flexible so you can use a little bit of pressure. And that's it. You can purchase that at your hardware store or from the manufacturer that made the toilet. So you simply take the new flapper, stretch it over the hole like so. Now we need to position it back inside of the tank. Again, you do it on a little bit of an angle like you did to take it out. Twist it so it's straight. And you shouldn't be able to pull up on this flapper if it's installed properly. Turn your water back on. We're going to wait until the tank fills up and we're going to do the three tests that we talked about earlier and identifying whether or not your flapper needs to be changed to ensure that we've got it installed properly and the new rubber is working properly. I'm going to take a piece of toilet tissue and I'm going to rub all around the inside rim in my toilet bowl to dry it off. This will make it easier to identify whether or not there's any streams of water coming down into my bowl. Okay, and listen to your toilet. And no signs of water. So it sounds good. Now I'm going to show you how to change out the flapper on a traditional style toilet. Similar to the dual flush toilet, you need to shut the water feed off to your toilet and completely drain down the tank. As soon as your tank is completely drained with water, now you're ready to remove your flapper. Simply remove the chain from the handle on your toilet tank. Pull the flapper off of the pegs that are located on the side of your fill valve. Now you're gonna to wanna to take a rag and wipe around the top side of the fill valve so that you can remove any debris that might be sitting there. Let's take your new flapper, place it over the hole, and attach it to the pegs on the side of your fill valve. Now you're gonna to wanna to take the chain and hook it to the handle of the toilet. 
You want to make sure that your chain has a little bit of slack, but not too much that it could possibly go underneath your flapper. And there you go. Changing your toilet flapper is just that easy. If your home or cottage is on a septic system, or you own a low flow or dual flush toilet, or you tend to use a lot of toilet paper at one time, try Majesta Easy Flush Bathroom Tissue. As this shake test will show you, Majesta Easy Flush breaks down quickly in water. Be sure to try it in your RV, too. And make sure you check out our information video on low flow or dual flush toilets and why installing one could be a good fit for your household and the environment. I'm Tammy Buchanan. Here's hoping all your toilet fixes are easy ones. Music to my ears. <laughs>